very important that we are really, really solid in our fundamentals. Okay? So, he's got his full guard on me. Okay? He is hiking his butt up on my thighs. Okay, you see that? That's how he's going to try to get his posture better than mine. Right? That's how he's going to try not to let me break his guard over by riding up my legs. So what do I do? I have to get good posture. I have to open my knees, okay? I have to lean forward, right? I have to get my knees out enough to where I can put his butt on the floor, and then I'm gonna sit like a samurai. My left hand is gonna grab his belt. My knuckles are gonna go right into his soft spot, like that liver, okay? Right, right into there. I'm gonna push hard in there, and then my palm is gonna come on the hip bone on the other side. Just like so. Boom. Okay? A lot of people teach this method, right? Of holding the trip skin. Why I don't like to teach this to white belts is because a lot of times they'll come this way and they'll forget about their arm. Next thing you know, their arm bar, triangles, all that kind of stuff. Okay? So by leaving it here, if he sits up, I can still put pressure enough to sit him back down. I can have my palm on his hip, and now I pin his butt to the floor. Okay? Now the side that's grabbing his belt, that knee is going to go to his, his tailbone. Lean forward, slide to the tailbone. Right leg's going to come 45 degree angle back, and look at that. I've got tension there. See that? My butt right there above my butt, i got tension. All i got to do now is i got to sit back, push hard, and break it over. Boop. Broke it over. Okay? Create the tension first, and then boop, pop it over. Hand on the belt, palm, push down. Knee comes behind, 45 degrees, there's the tension right there. Okay, and now all I gotta do is finish and sit. Just like so. Elbow comes inside, and now I'm gonna pursue my next position. Okay, one more time on that. Okay, posture up, samurai, hand on the belt, lean forward, hand on the hip. Okay, knee to the tailbone. 45 degree angle backwards, and push and pop it up. You know what I mean? There you go. Good. Now knee in the middle. Knee on the side that you have the knuckles in. Yeah. So if you want to, you want to switch it up. There you go. And then 45. Elbow pressure out. Back. Up. you have one. Remember. Yeah, it looks good. Yeah, it looks good. 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 And this is what I call in jiu-jitsu, there's always going to be dog fight position. Where that, that, that dog fight happens, right? Where you guys are fighting to get out of each other. He's holding on half to stay and I'm holding on half to go, right? We're right at that half point. So, first thing that happens, I get put in this half guard. Alec is here. I want to cross face, put my fingers in his top armpit but cross face, right? So I'm gonna flatten him out, okay? So my bicep is gonna go to his mouth, okay? I'm gonna give him my bicep, like so. Boom, right? And I'm gonna flatten him out, okay? Once he's flattened, let's just... Once he's flattened, okay, I'm gonna push, and now these fingers are gonna reach as far as I can to get underneath this armpit. You guys see that? So I'm here, I'm fighting, and I get under the armpit, okay? Now, I want to pull him towards me. This is the most important part of this whole technique, guys. I need to pull Coach Alec towards me. Pull, okay? I need to pull him towards me. I need to bend his body, boom. And now, this shoulder stays underneath his chin, okay, on his neck. So I pull, and I drive forward. Okay, creating a lot of pressure on his face. Just like that, okay? Sometimes the guys will just let you pass right there and go tap, too much pressure, okay? So now look, as soon as I get there, I'm gonna reach back down, push my knee out, 
and then put it on the floor. Boom. Okay? Notice, guys, I keep my shoulder under his chin the whole time. My hand postures here so he can't roll me that way. If he tries to roll me the other way, I have my foot. Okay? Head comes down. Foot comes in. Prize it open. And slide right to the full mount. I don't want to have my shoulder go to the top of his head. I want my shoulder to stay underneath the chin, under here, okay? Keep it there and you'll never have a problem. Keep the fingers in the armpit, pull, drive. Post your hand, knee to the floor, post your leg. Okay, so you're, you have a, a, a balance either way. Then, head goes down, butt comes up, feet come in, pry yourself up. I'm in half guard, he's turned towards me, turned towards me. I'm gonna bicep to his face and flatten him out. Okay, you guys see that? I'm gonna reach, I'm gonna push his hand up and I'm gonna grab over his armpit. I'm gonna pull towards me and I'm gonna drive hard. I'm gonna slide my knee out, my knee's gonna come to the floor, my head is on the floor, hand is in posture here, Foot is posture here. You can't push me either way. Time to pass. Put my foot inside. Pry it open. Straight them out.